set it to your new uh, improvements to our zero integration with the ability to pull out your specific chart of accounts. I've actually gone ahead and skipped the process of authenticating into zero. I'll make sure to include links uh, below with instructions on how to do that uh, in case you're unfamiliar. But in this case, I'm already um, integrated with my zero account. And what you'll see when you click into this are some of the same metrics that uh, you know you've seen in the past uh, from the different reporting. So uh, revenue, net income, and et cetera. Uh, but now you can actually pull out specific chart of accounts from your respective zero account. So maybe I wanted to pull in things like uh, wages and salaries, rent, and uh, advertising expenses. I can do that. Uh, you can also click and, and search from all of these. I'm gonna go ahead and click continue. Uh, we'll grab this uh, data out from zero automatically like we have with all of our integrations. And as a friendly reminder, you know, every night we go in and we grab that updated data automatically for you. So once this is completed, uh, we'll be able to chart and create reports for any of these metrics. You can always edit this and grab more metrics and bring those into zero as well. And I'll, I'll show you how to do that uh, as, as part of this. Great, so we have those metrics ready to go. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and just go over and, and create a chart from some of these metrics. So I'm gonna go ahead and add wages and salaries, advertising expenses, rent, and revenue. So you can put all of these metrics on the same chart. I'm gonna go ahead, make this a column chart, stack this, save it to my dashboard, and now we have some zero metrics that are ready to go. Uh, you can quickly click down, click add to update, and be ready to send this. The last thing I'll show you, as I mentioned before, is uh, you're able to edit this integration at any time. So if I wanted to edit this, I can come in here and pull more metrics. So maybe I wanted to pull in uh, common stock in addition to bank revaluations. I can bring those into my zero integration, pull them in automatically, and begin reporting on those. Hope you enjoy. Feel free to uh, email us with any questions or ways we can help.